New developments in an I-team investigation involving police activity at a local mayor's house. Port Ritchie Mayor Dale Massad and his longtime girlfriend Kai Joseph were arrested last night on domestic violence charges. Yeah, ABC Action News I-team investigator Adam Walser has been looking into issues at the mayor's house for months now. Adam? That's right. Mayor Del Massad spent his first full night in jail last night. And as we first reported last month, he and his girlfriends have had a long history of trouble. Port Ritchie Mayor Dale Massad walked up to a different type of podium than he's used to Friday. Good afternoon, sir. Good afternoon. Massad was arrested after deputies say he grabbed longtime girlfriend Kai Joseph and pushed her to the ground. You are charged with domestic battery or bond is zero. Can you afford to hire your own attorney? Yes. In July, we reported police have been to Massad's house four dozen times, but he had never been charged with a crime. At that time, he blamed police activity on his girlfriends. You look at that, see if I made any calls. Okay, so they made all the calls. They you were the ones, look, uh, yeah, they were the ones they causing are the trouble. One. Joseph, who was also arrested Thursday, was charged half a dozen other times for battery and violating protection orders at Massad's home. You know, I'm a felon, and it took a lot to get me, um, you know, I went back there, and um, I just, I, I don't want to be there. She told the judge she couldn't make a $500 bond. I don't know how to get out of here. I don't know anyone I know. He, he's not going to get me out. Port Ritchie City Manager instructed the Pasco Sheriff's Office to investigate the case. We were unable to reach him for comment. Local residents had plenty to say. Well, if you're in the city, you get rid of him because it's a bad example for everybody else. You know, what he did was wrong. I don't think he should have assaulted her, but he shouldn't have, she shouldn't have assaulted him. Massad and Joseph were ordered not to have any contact with each other after they're released on $500 bonds. Now, Mayor Massad denied the allegations and said he plans to plead not guilty. A misdemeanor conviction would not affect his ability to serve an elected office. I'm my team investigator Adam Walser taking action for you.